All right, we finally got a nice little setup going on. The dogs are in this room for the first time in a while. This used to be my craft room, but now since I'm pregnant, it is now the baby's room and I'm so excited and I'm just so like, this room has me so excited because we got the dresser in, we got the little uh, cabinet stuff in. I don't even know what to call it, but I'm pretty sure the baby's going to use it like with toys or we're going to put like toys in the future and stuff in there. I don't know. The baby oddly does not have any toys. She has two dolls. One that she, I don't want her playing with because it's so nice because my, my great grandmother made it. Her great great grandmother made it and there's another doll in here that she'll be able to play with when she gets older. But other than that, she doesn't really have a lot of toys. So this little area that we have I've been putting like baby products and diapers and stuff in there for now but this wall is going to be the crib but the bassinet the crib the changing table we still got to put all of those together so if you want to see all that make sure you subscribe this video is all about her clothes well not really her she's got so many clothes and so many uh, separate, I don't know how to call it. She has pretty much what I'm categor categorizing in three videos. She's got her hand-me-down clothes, which were given by friends and family that did not need these clothes anymore. She's also, she's also going to have a uh, pretty much an Amazon registry uh, clothes video and then she's gonna have her baby shower clothes video because we had people give us hand-me-downs and we also had people send via Am Amazon all the baby stuff because they couldn't make it to the baby shower so they sent all of her stuff on Amazon and I have like a whole bunch of Amazon boxes it's not even funny and of course we got stuff from the baby shower so she's got a whole bunch of clothes and they're so cute I feel like the hand-me-down clothes are the cutest to be honest but the baby shower clothes are the most like well thought out and they're really nice and really like I'm surprised we got so many so I'm excited to show y'all and I'm filming these videos all day today so if you see me wearing the same outfit in three videos just know it's all about her clothes or if you see me in a vlog with the same outfit on just know that it was the same day that I was filming this video so, so we gotta hurry and get through all these clothes I'm also they're not I have not washed these clothes yet so I'm putting them straight into a little hamper thing that I got this is one that I like this is mine that I've had for the longest time so I'm just gonna put all the clothes in here because I don't want to use our everyday regular uh, baskets and stuff because Josh's dirty clothes and stuff I don't want to get mud all over these nice baby clothes this is from her aunt Melissa or no 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 but to get started she's got this little onesie that's like the cutest it has a little owl on it and we got a cute little bathing suit or no I think this is just a regular onesie I keep calling it a bathing suit, but it's not, it doesn't feel like bathing suit material, but it's super cute and it'll be super cute for 4th of July and it still has the tags on it in zero to three months. She'll be born in March, so April, May, June, hopefully she'll still fit in it by the time 4th of July comes around because she'll be like three going on four months. Then we got, oh, this one goes from the back, another onesie. It's a long sleeve. I think it's so cute and it has little ruffles on it. And then this one, it says, if you think I'm cute, you should see my aunts. So I feel like that one's cute. Or I'm going to say cute all the time in this video. These are all like the cutest little outfits ever. And I'm so thankful that I have these. This is a onesie and it's a button up, but it buttons all the way from the back of the legs to the back. And it has little strawberries. Then she's got this little cute little dress, probably a newborn size dress. She might wear this on Easter. Have no clue. 
no telling what she's going to be wearing throughout this year. And I think this is a little cute. It kind of looks like a little Moroccan style, Greek, Greece style dress. So, so cute. Cutest little bathing suit. So hopefully she'll be able to fit in through this by the summer. It's for three months. So hopefully we don't know how big she's going to be or how long she'll be. But hopefully... I'm hoping she's going to be a little tiny baby because apparently I was a tiny baby when I was younger and I could fit in like the smallest of clothes when I was younger. So hopefully she's the same way. But uh, this one says wonderfully made. I thought it was cute. And it's good that these, a lot of these are long sleeves because she'll be born and it's probably in March. So it'll probably still be cold. I like these little dresses she's got. Well, I think they're shirts. So she'll have to wear leggings with them and stuff. But it's super cute. And then this one's kind of the ooh, 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 ooh. This one's kind of the same. And it has little lace on the back. It's a cute little outfit. And then we got a headband for her. So I can't wait for her to wear this cute little headband. Then we have a onesie. This is a fishing, or oh, fishing hair, don't care. And it looks like it has like some HTV or heat transfer vinyl on it. So that would be cute for summer for daddy to show off his baby. We got one of these. I forgot what brand this is called where it's like these little kids or whatever but I grew up with those and I thought these were cute and then she's got a zebra tutu looking onesie this is three to six so this one would be for later and we got a little bitty tiny shorts I can't wait to see her in like little bitty shorts like that's so cute and then this one's like a, oh, it's a skort. It has like little, uh, has that on underneath. So she'll be cute. And this one I thought was so cute because it's like a little roughly dress. Or I think it's, oh, I tied it wrong. But these are the straps. But this is the front of the dress. So it has a little bow and it has little ruffles on the butt. Sorry, pregnancy brain at its best. My arms are getting tired though. And I don't know which outfit this went to, but I'm pretty sure it went to an outfit that's still in here. This is cute little onesie. And then we got these little sets. I love these sets. If on, on Amazon, if you look up infant or toddler sets, they sell them for like 20 bucks and you get like five outfits out of them. Like I think one of them she has to where you could literally get like six outfits out of the four piece set that she had. Because it was like two onesies, um, two pairs of pants, and then a jacket. But then I think there were shorts with it or something. But you can make like a whole bunch of different outfits for the summer or the spring. Same thing with these. This is like a little headband. This is also for three to six months. Although this kind of looks big for three to six months. Or maybe not. Maybe all together it just looks big. But um. Oh it's a little onesie. And it has. And it's like a dress. Yeah it's connected. It's like a onesie dress. And then it has a jacket. From the back but I think you or no that's the front so this is the front of the jacket so she'll be cute and comfy but you know she could wear it as a summer dress or add it for you when the weather gets cold outside and I want to say she got yeah there's another one so she got or the 
she has two of those which you can never have enough outfits so if you ever see her in the same outfit twice she is not an outfit repeater she probably has twice of the same outfit and Josh probably put her in it leggings it says little lamb I love you more so this is the silk printing I was talking about I think it's so cute pretty eyes and chubby thighs this is another one piece set it has a dress and or it's got the onesie dress the jacket and it has a matching bow but so cute she has the same outfit and then here's like a smaller set of that same outfit so I think this one, yeah, this is a newborn. This one says eat more tacos. This is a six to 12 month. And then this one says merry and bright. I don't think she'll fit into this one when she, during Christmas, but again, she could uh, be a tiny little baby, but this is a newborn size. So she probably won't be able to wear this, but we don't know how big she's gonna be. So I'm pretty sure she won't be that tiny, but you never know. And then we got zero to three leggings. These leggings, zero to three month, a little unicorn onesie. Leggings, leggings, <laughs> more leggings. Leggings with ruffles. This is a shirt, be brave and strong. So her little belly is gonna be poking out of this one. We, ri or we rise by lifting others, which I thought it's a cute shirt. This one says stand tall. It's another six to 12, three to six month. And it says joyful. And I think this is a newborn. And it says love you dearly. This one is from our friends Alex and Jessica. They just had a baby. And their baby was literally born, I think, possibly two months apart from our baby and the reason why I say it possibly is because you never know when our baby's gonna be born so our baby's not born yet <sighs> Kimber has a toy and when she plays with it it sounds like a bag of chips so every time she plays with it I think she's getting into chips I'm sorry I'm sorry I didn't know you were playing our friends Alex and Jessica gave us some clothes uh, I think our baby at 40 weeks exact will be two uh, months, if not two and a half months, three months uh, difference from their daughter. Or no, three months. Maybe even four or five. Their baby was born before the holidays, I believe. I can't remember. It's hard to keep up with all the babies being born here lately because there's a lot. <laughs> and our baby is one of them. But... They let us have some of her hand-me-downs and oh my gosh. Either they had the tiniest baby or what because I have not seen a newborn onesie this small. So this is a zero to three months and this is like the tiniest little one but it has little flowers on it. And then little onesie with flowers. Well, yeah. About to say it's like the same thing pretty much. But it's so cute. Little, I thought this was funny because it had a little monkey on it. So she's going to be all warm in her little footsie pajamas that she has. And then we got this one. I think this is the one that ties at the bottom. And we got a matching bow. Jacket. This says Little Miss Magnolia, but I don't know if that's just a saying or something. More leggings. More leggings. I'm not complaining because you can never have too many leggings. We got more jeans. A cute little dress. Onesie. Another onesie. And this one has a frog on it. This one has a little elephant on it, which we are declaring like elephants are going to be her thing. Her papa was wondering what kind of Build-A-Bear we should get her or what I wanted her to have and we couldn't think of it and I was like well duh elephant like Ellie elephant or whatever and uh we were like duh like me and the whole family we forgot that you know 
not that this room is going to be themed elephants or whatever but i just thought ellie and her to have like her little elephant would be cute instead of like a regular teddy bear but this says sweet yeah this one has the cow on it, it has a little mini cow so super cute your little frilly onesie onesie i just think it's so fun looking at all these little cute onesies so we got all different kinds of pink onesies and all different kinds of, you know, roughly onesies. And this is my first baby, so bear with me. Like just seeing all these outfits are just so cute. But we got this little, I think it's like a dress, but it has like leg holes. But it looks like kind of like a little bitty dress. This one has little cherries on it. I think most of these are from, okay, this one's just one year, but they're by Carter's. So a lot of these are from Carter's, not sponsored. But if you're wondering where all these cute stuff came from, I think everything that I've pulled out so far is from Carter's. So this one says, I'm a little lady. So cute. Oh goodness. Yep. We got a I love dad shirt. Had to have one of those in there. Little bear with a bow. It's so cute. And it's got a little hat. It says, nobody puts baby in the corner. So cute. And it's a little uh, sleeveless or tank. So this is a newborn. My heart belongs to daddy. Mama's, Mama's mini, of course. Glitter in my veins, Jesus in my heart. It's cute. This one says, I was worth the wait. Definitely was. There's a little, oh, it's so cute. It's a little foot, or onesie, footsie, pajama. Got an owl on it, so cute. I just can't wait to put her in these. Like that's the one thing hard about this is seeing all the clothes and wanting to put her in everything I see, but I can't because she's not here. And I want her to be here so I can start making her cute outfits. Or parent, you know, taking pictures of her cute outfits. Because I'm pretty sure Instagram is going to be blown up with my baby. Like I said, I think her daughter was born during the holidays. I don't think... Well, she might be big enough to wear this. But this is Baby Cat and Jack Newborn. And it says RN. I don't know what RN stands for. But Newborn. And this doesn't have a bottom like it doesn't have any bloomers in it so it just slips on over i don't think she'll be able to fit in this at that point but you never know that's definitely going to get hung up though and then we got a little onesie it says hello world or this goes with that dress it's a little furry jacket so it'd be cute and then we got little onesie it's like a little bear onesie it's so cute it's flannel and it has little ears that's so cute another little elephant onesie gift from god cute and then it says that bow though that's cute and we got another little fitzy onesie a little bunny on it so cute little onesie this is a little t-shirt with a little elephant on it more leggings I'm pretty sure they probably go with that elephant shirt then we got another little I think this is you know it has a foots it has it's a footsie pajama set and it has little castle unicorns and princesses on it we got winter friend on the front another footsie pajamas with bunnies sloths and foxes on it and porcupines and owls so yeah it's got a lot of animals on it oh um, this one says happy sailing oh it's like a little mermaid the last of this box which makes me sad every time i get down to the bottom of the boxes because they're just all so cute jacket or onesie with a cupcake on it Leggings with a cupcake on the butt, so I'm pretty sure it goes with that onesie. Oh, <gasps> little camo, which we are not opposed to camo on girls. Like, we are definitely that mom and dad. 
camo is going to be everything and she's going to wear it and rock it so uh, this one says hey y'all so cute and that's it from her or from Alex and Jessica which thank you very much that again that was a lot of clothes inside that tiny little box <laughs> like you don't realize how tiny baby clothes are until you get like a whole box of them and you're like that's a lot of clothes I'm pretty sure she's probably gonna have onesies for days but I did hear that just because you know she's gonna be small and might grow fast she's gonna be spitting up a lot and changing outfits a lot so to have a, plenty of onesies and to have plenty of newborn to you know to 12 years old like it's really good for kids that age to have a lot of clothes because they do go through them so much but then out at the same time they grow out of them just as fast so it's kind of like I'm glad we have all these clothes because just in case she spits up a lot which if I breastfeed I heard that breastfeeding kids actually do not spit up a lot so we're hoping that doesn't happen and that she get to wear that she gets to wear her outfits but she's probably gonna have like a million outfits to wear all day and I'm probably gonna put her in different outfits all day just because but we're gonna move on to her other Aunt Caitlin. She has two Aunt Caitlins, but, so she technically has two Aunt Caitlins. Jordan and Katie is gonna be Aunt KK, and then Austin and Caitlin is probably gonna be Aunt, Aunt Kaykin, because that's what all of her nephews um, names her, so she is probably gonna be the same, and just call her Kaykin, but unless our daughter just does not want to call her Kaykin and call her Caitlin, she'll probably call her Caitlin. So, or probably call her Aunt KK. So she might have two Aunt KKs, but we're going to try to differentiate the two. So, yep. Weston's like just sleeping on the ground. I wish I was taking a nap. <laughs> but this is from her Uncle Austin and Aunt KK. So, we got this cute little beanie. And I'm wondering if there's like a matching onesie, but we'll wait and see. I'll just put this on the side to show it together. But it's so cute. I like the little woodland nature theme. But I also love this. I love the cheetah print. And this is for a 6 to 12 month. So I can't believe her daughter already grew out of this. Like holy crap. But <laughs> 6 to 12 months. Hopefully Ellie fits in this at the end of the year. We got a little burp, burp cloth. Which thank goodness. You just throw it over. I'm excited. Like, I just, oh, makes me so excited. So, and then, oh, this is like a little hat. So cute. So, little bonnet. And then, little onesie with woodland animal, animals on it. So, we got bears, foxes, porcupines, and, or I think they're hedgehogs. But, super cute. And then we got this cute little onesie. Little floral. Super cute. And it says Daddy's Little Girl, M Mommy's World. And it, I think it bunched up in the washer or something. But I don't care. Our daughter's going to wear anything and everything. So. Oh, another little. This is like a little. It doesn't have the feet or anything at the bottom. It's kind of like just a little sleeping bag for them to sleep in so that they don't crawl or kick around or anything. And then we got another one. It has little owls on it. Little tutu legging set. Super cute. And this is like a little linen. It's like linen cottony. I think it's more of linen. I can never tell the difference between linen and cotton because they all like they're that material that's I think this is cotton because linen wrinkles up easily and this has been in the box for a while so I think this is cotton but it's like a little bloomer we got another little bow and then more bloomers and then we got some little bitty socks they're so tiny oh tiny little toes so, I don't think I'm going to wash these. Yeah, they smell really good. So, I'm not going to wash those only because they're so tiny and I don't want them to get lost in the washer. These are from her Aunt KK because 
I found these. I don't know why I, like I was looking dead at them and I just love that feeling. That was like the best feeling in the world because I was like, oh, I was like, now we got to move on to the Amazon stuff, which I'm still excited about those and show y'all. But this one, yeah, I'm so mad at myself. I almost like missed this bag. So we got little tutu and it's so cute i wish she was born right on valentine's day or near valentine's day because she won't be able to wear this but she will still be rocking the red this cute little onesie it's three months old oh wait it buttons up in the front this is the front cute little onesie more camo this one has little hearts on it i don't know if this is a mouse it's probably a mouse but it looks like a little bunny to me chiffon top or satin top like it's really nice and flowy so yeah hello world got this little cupcake onesie oh, oh, oh that's almost dropping a little fourth of july onesie little ladybug dress onesie another little i think these are so cute the little spaghetti straps but this one has life is sweet with mommy we got another little floral onesie. Hello sunshine. Super cute for summer. Little onesie with little, uh, I forgot what you call these, but this little thing, pom-poms. Leggings, but they got monkey on the butt. Murka. Little dress. This is one of them little gowns. Top. Another, well this is like a romper onesie. Little gray onesie with a little kitty in the pocket. Another little onesie, where it's like a romper. Fourth of July dress onesie. Bitty bitty and pretty onesie. So cute. Shirt dress with a little bird or, yeah, little birds at the bottom. Let's see pajamas. Super cute. Oh, this is so tiny. How is a baby this tiny? This is newborn, but also, you know, just in case she's a preemie, it's good to have those little tiny ones. This is like a polo shirt type onesie. It feels like a polo shirt or like a school shirt. This says, I'm so super sweet. It's from Baby Gap and it's like a little nice little like waffle. I want to say it's a waffle pattern, but it's like super tiny, but super cute. She's going to have all the clothes in the world. She's not going to be an outfit repeater, that's for sure. And then more leggings. This one has little ruffles at the bottom. I can't wait. And then onesie, and it says, I, I heart sunny days, more leggings, little nice flowy shirt, oh, and this one's the cutest, little flannel, super cute, it says, mommy sweetie, the little hearts, and it's ruffled, but it's a shirt, this is like the footsie pajamas, I can't wait, well, it's not footsie pajamas, it has like, the leg openings right here but that one is so cute little dress oh this one was a one that josh was like what the heck <laughs> but it's a onesie or it's a little like summer onesie and it crosses in the back leggings and tutu leggings i thought was the cutest Oh, I think this is the front but what it is is a onesie and it has like a little bow tie on it and it has like a little neck thing but it also has like armholes it's really hard to see but it's uh, deer printed but it's like a little dress I don't know if you can tell it's a onesie and it has little ruffles and it has little or wait no that's the back I think you just tie those together so it's like an off-the-shoulder type thing onesie leggings shorts super cute more little well i think these are bloomers little onesie and then yeah little onesie little tutu coolest baby ever it says you are my sunshine super cute flora onesie as can be has little kitties on it one says mommy's little butterball so she'll be able to wear this hopefully 
during Thanksgiving, which is going to be so cute. Leggings. Or bell-bottom leggings. A cute little dress. This one has monkeys on the leggings. It has little monkey foot things. So cute. That is the end of this hand-me-down video. Uh, I would, again, thanks to all that like gave us their hand-me-down clothes we do not turn down anything because one hard times two um like it's just nice and so grateful that we have clothes for our baby and such nice clothes for our baby i don't know how to explain it and i don't want to get too emotional i'm just thankful for the people that uh helped you know clothe our baby pretty much. Thank y'all for sending these clothes to us and thank y'all for letting our daughter be a part of your lives, I wanna say. I don't know. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you for those who gave us these nice clothes and please make sure you watch the other videos which is going to be the clothes that I got from Amazon, from friends and family, and then also some clothes that we got from the baby shower so there's she's got a lot of clothes we are good on clothes but we are good on clothes for like the next year or two literally so i'm just so grateful and thank you again bye